Hello everyone. I'm sitting in the car waiting for my daughter in dance class. I was going to try to walk, but it's 80 degrees and bright sun. And because of my medication, I was supposed to be in the sun. So I'm going to have to wait till later in the day. Um, but I wanted to talk about October. Um, I know it's um, a little bit ways, but it's coming up soon. I was going to do make a shirt for breast cancer awareness. And then if people wanted to give me a name of somebody I know that is fighting breast cancer or has had breast cancer and is not, you know, in remission or anything, I'll put their name on the back of their shirt. And when I go walking, I'll put like um, walking for awareness and then put their names underneath. So when I'm out walking, people can know that October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. So if anybody has anybody they like to add to it, just leave it in the comments and I will add it to the shirt. And then I'll take a picture of the shirt and you can add it anytime because I have a cricket at home. I can just add the name. And um, so anytime in October, um, let me know if you know anybody and I'll add it to the shirt. So, and I'm also doing Derek Journey's um, step challenge again for um, October. So that's going to help getting me out and about and getting more, you know, steps in. And so that way there's more awareness too. And I'm getting healthy at the same time. So something I really wanted to do, um, cancer runs in our different cancer runs in my family. So I'm going to try to do as many as I can, if I can, you know, for the shirt colors to do one each month. I missed the childhood cancer this month. Um, just being sick and everything, I wasn't able to get a shirt and get it done. So hopefully next time I'll be able to do that. Um, so yeah, that's my plan for October. So if you know anybody, like I said, comment below. So I'm going to be doing that. And then I think you still have time to sign up for Derek's journeys step challenge so go to his channel and there should be a video that talks about that and you can email him with your um if you don't do youtube you can still sign up just give him your name and like a little photo and he'll put it in his video that you're doing it and put you on a team so yeah check that out you don't have to have be on youtube um anybody can do it it's a group thing, but also individual, like I said before, to do, you motivate yourself to get your steps in and be part of um, people who are trying to walk more and get healthy. So, yeah, they're really great people. They're motivating. They'll email you or any way you want to be contacted to keep, you know, you motivated and see how you're doing and, you know, get your steps. And so check them out and sign up for that. So those are two things. Um, my mom is on a three month waiting list to see a neurog neuro neurological specialist to find out why her vision's not improving like they said it would after 24 hours. And everything takes time because you have to get a referral and then the insurance has to improve it and then the referral gets sent and it's just a big old mess. So she has excuse me a few of them that she's waiting on so I guess that's it since I talked to you yesterday um I'm gonna try to walk more after I take my kids to school in the morning I'm gonna do it before it gets too sunny and too hot out that way you don't have to worry about being on these antibiotics where you're not supposed to be on the sun because in the morning it's still overcast and stuff so that's what I'm gonna be doing so join me in walking, um, leave a name down below if you want, or if there's a cancer that you want awareness for and want me to make a shirt and wear it on my walks, let me know. And I will also try to get that color shirt and get it made and do it during that month. Um, so yeah, any other awarenesses or any other reason you want me, I'd be glad to do it to, since I'm going to be out around the neighborhood and excuse me on the parks and stuff. So. I'm still battling the um, medicine they gave me. It's really drying me out. And 
when I do longer periods of time in between it, um, my eyes and stuff do water, but then it does help my ears come unclogged. So I think the medicine's drying me out too much, and I'm still having to call the doctor every day to ask if there's something else or if there's less, you know, milligrams I can take of it so it's not bothering me with the headaches and stuff because I still want to be able to get out there and do my walks and I take care of the kids and other things. So I'm working on that. Um, kind of, sorry, kind of all over place, but that's what's been going on and what I want to do for October. So I hope everybody's doing well and I will talk to you soon. Thank you.